The city moved fast to put a controversial Juan de Oñate statue in storage after a protest over it ended in a shooting. But one year later, the city is no closer to a final decision on what to do with it. News 13's Chris McKee explains. The city's Race in History and Healing Project published a report in December suggesting that the Oñate and the other statues making up the La Ornada statue exhibit may be permanently removed from the corner of 19th and Mountain. That's what that report suggested. But since then, with the pandemic in mind, city councilors haven't made any moves. Although it's been a year since we've had these discussions initially, I think we still just need to wait to ensure that we all voices are at the table and being heard. And, you know, not everyone's vaccinated. We're not 100% open. Now, since that Oñate statue came down, the rest of the La Ornada statue has remained untouched outside of the Albuquerque Museum. A spokeswoman for the mayor's office told us today that the final statue's location decision rests ultimately with city council. Councilor Cynthia Borrego recently proposed a bill to solidify no new changes, alterations or related actions for the statue until after the criminal investigation related to the shooting is over. That could be a long time. Borrego told us today that she is postponing any council votes on her proposed bill until September, saying it's too early to raise a quote divisive issue. There's also a mayoral election happening this year. Councilor Clarissa Pena helped lead the charge, starting the community discussions over the statue's future. We asked her today if the decision at all is being delayed because of the possible or the election. You know, I've heard from lots of constituents in my community and, you know, I think that we have a lot of people who are obviously indigenous and um, Hispanic, Latino, Chicano, however they identify mestizos who, who really, you know, really are passionate about this and really want the right thing to be done. Now, council has no mandate on when they must decide what is next for the statue. Meanwhile, the city has moved ahead with renaming the Oñate Park to Brentwood Hills Park in northeast Albuquerque. They also renamed Kit Carson Park near the zoo to Rio Grande Park. Back to you. All right, Chris, thank you. Albuquerque, of course, is not the only city wrestling with a monument controversy. As you know, Santa Fe removed the obelisk from the plaza in Santa Fe and has not yet made a decision on its future.